Brian here with you. Welcome into my office. Let's take a look at this beautiful early 20th century two-volume set, The Life uh, of the Duke of Devonshire. A very pleasing spines uh, on this two-volume set. Almost Art Nouveau floral patterning in the compartments with raised bands with gilt rules, 1911 at the base of the spine. The bindings uh, display signs of time uh, and handling and as well as some darkening here and for instance here like this, some dark staining that's old. Uh, the joint is uh, scuffed and cracking. However, I will say that both covers do remain uh, firmly and well attached. There is an early owner's book plate here uh, and Let's take a look. We have a half title. Then we have this very nice, uh, like a photogravure plate uh, of the man himself, evidently. Uh, it's here, Longman's Green and Company, and it is in two volumes complete with portraits, etc. Uh, this is somebody's early calling card uh, there. And here is the uh, contents list. The man evidently was involved in India, Irish, Egypt, war, and so on in the late Victorian era. Uh, here's a list of the illustrations. At the back is this map of the Anglo-Egyptian Sudan, and we'll take a look at that in a moment. And here we go. We see that the interior is tight, clean, and sound. It appears to be uh, include uh, also some of his letters that he wrote. Uh, like so. And when we get to the rear here, this is the fold-out map where you'll notice that this could be folded out and examined like this while reading the text. This is an intentional feature of the book done by the publisher. And uh, there's a little a tiny bit of chipping at the head of the spine on this volume, and the second volume is in a similar state of uh, preservation, which is to say, a uh, very pleasing uh, and nice looking. However, it's not perfect. Uh, there are, uh, there is a little bit here of chipping at the head, some darkening down here, and so on. But again, the covers are firm uh, and tight. The contents are square. The uh, book is uh, still well bound. The leather is supple. The contents and interior is clean. And here is another photogravure of the man himself late in life uh, or later in life. And here's a list of the contents. Uh, you see here, it appears to continue up into the beginning of the 20th century. Here's a list of uh, further illustrations. Uh, and so that is how this two volume set survives. Uh, and it is available now online from me, Brian DeMambro.